guys I am so excited for this video let's get right to it I'm gonna start off by picking up all of the clothes and then I'm gonna follow by picking up all of the trash it's gonna make a huge difference in this area picking up the, the book bags off of the floors right now I'm trying to cut off this light string my son for some reason decided to put these light strings in his room and it got tangled and I'm just gonna cut them off and throw them away I don't even care to save them At this point, I am thanking God for good knees because you really need Megan the Stallion knees <laughs> to clean up in my son's room. And even when you're next to me, I feel like you are gone. It's all the things you never show. This scarf is hilarious to me. Um, I this video I recorded this today at six o'clock this morning. I was up at five, and I'm like, I promised him this video. Let me get to it. Um, so ignore my scarf. But anywho, now I am removing these wires. It's um like fairy lights I want to say they they light up and they're battery operated my son put batteries in them opened them up and he installed them across his bed and onto this de decor um, so now I'm just removing it and again I did cut the bottom part earlier so it's not gonna work I am just gonna trash this to save the headache after that was taken care of, I looked underneath the bed and to my horror, I found all of this stuff. So now I have to, I have to get it. <laughs>
right guys, so now I'm just continuing to pick up a million items off of the floors. Honestly, this is probably the messiest his room has ever been. And I don't think that it's him by himself. My oldest son will come into his room for some reason. I don't, reasoning, well, reason. I don't know if it's still. Oh my gosh, why can't I talk this morning? I don't know if it's sibling. Rivalry. Oh my gosh, I'm just. You know what? Let me get back to this cleaning. Okay, I had to take a little break there. But what I was saying was um, sometimes my older son, he will like come into my youngest son's room and he will put like dishes and everything underneath the bed. Um, I don't know why he does that. Maybe it's because it's easier than walking down the steps to put it in the sink. I am not sure. But he does it and hopefully he grows out of it. This was just really a wake up call that I should be coming into his room and looking underneath his bed and behind his bed at all times. I am really enjoying vacuuming this floor. Um, I am going to go in a little later with the carpet cleaner for you guys so that you can see my process of how I clean the carpets. guys so now I'm going in with my Bissell carpet cleaner and I am going to get these stains up on this side of the room it is a long time coming and I am so glad that I have this because it is way more um, it's cheaper to just go ahead and carpet clean your carpet yourself I will get it professionally clean once a year but any other time I love having this because it helps me to stay on top of things especially with you know a younger child. satisfying but still also very concerning to me because I'm like oh my gosh this is so dirty this is going to take a million passes before this water starts to become clearer.
right guys so this is the third pass i did about four passes all together and i will say that 99 percent of the stuff that was on the floors it did come out with the exception of um permanent marker blue permanent permanent marker stains that you will see later on um if i had if I would have did like another pass on it, it would have came up, but my battery began to die and I knew that I needed to finish this video. So I will save that for another time. this gets up this red juice stain off of the floor um, there was still some close to the trim um, this part doesn't really get the trim areas really good but that handheld that I'll go in with earlier I mean earlier <laughs> later it's definitely going to get the rest of it up I absolutely love this carpet cleaner Here I'm just going in with the handheld tool and I'm just continuing to really go at the edges and I'm also using it on any stains that the bare portion did not get up. I've learned that the handheld part, it will get it up much better than the, the actual vacuum part.
just struggling to move this bed back into place just re-watching this is making my back hurt right now um, but I was able to successfully get it moved back by myself here I'm just removing the sheets and these pants that are on the bed so that I can <clears throat> excuse me wash them um, there is a mattress protector underneath here that definitely needs to be replaced as you can see it has a split in it um, but I will definitely get that taken care of just not today I could not for the life of me find the matching um, flat sheet to, well not flat sheet, but fitted sheet to this flat sheet. This flat sheet is actually the set that's supposed to be on here. So I just used one of my older son's um, flat sheets to make this bed until I can actually find the matching piece to it. some pillows for for this room and until I find the other one I'm just gonna randomly set these three pillows on this bed I think that it'll be just fine <laughs> too fancy just something basic to get it out of the way I no longer am ashamed to walk past this room it's clean enough for me I will go in on a later date and do some more things such as hole repair and all of that good stuff but for now I'm happy <laughs> <laughs> 